for the Passover and the festival of the unleavened bread. The chief priests and the scribes were looking for a way to arrest Jesus by stealth and kill him, for they said. Pleased and promised to give him money 
So he began to look for an opportunity to betray him. into the city and found things just as Jesus had told them. So they prepared the Oh, 
sung the hymn they went out to the Mount of Olives and Jesus said to I will strike the shepherd, and the sheep will be scattered, and after I am raised up, I will go before you to Galilee. But 
of Gethsemane. And he said to his disciples, Sit here while I pray. to them my soul is deeply grieved even to death remain here and keep The spirit is indeed willing, but the flesh is weak. And again he went away and prayed, saying the same words. And once more he came and found them sleeping. For the 
their eyes were very heavy, and they did not know what to answer him. He came a third time and said to them, Are you still sleeping and taking your rest? It is enough, the hour has come. Behold, the Son of Man is being betrayed into the hands of sinners. Rise, let us be going. See, my betrayal is at
answered and said to them, Have you come out as a guest a robber with swords and clubs to take
one of the female servants of the high priest came by. When she saw Peter warming himself, she stared at him and said, But he denied it, saying, I do not know or understand what you are talking about. And he went into the forecourt. Then the cock crowed. And the female servant on seeing him began again to say to the bystanders, This man is wonderful. But again he did it. And after a while the bystanders again said to Peter, But he began to curse, and he swore an oath. I do not know this man you are talking about. At that moment, the cock crowed for the second time. When Peter remembered that Jesus had said today, this very night, before the Thank you. 
that the chief priests had handed him over, but the chief priests stirred up the crowd to have him release the lovers for them instead. Pilate spoke to them again. Then what do you wish me to do with the man you call the king of the Jews? They shouted back. <laughs> Oh, 
For Simon of Simeon, the father of Alexander and Rufus. Then they brought Jesus to the place called Golgotha, which means place of a skull, and they offered him wine mixed with love, but he did not take it. And they crucified.
And someone ran for the sponge with sour wine, put it on a stick and gave it to him to drink, saying, When you get the sick, with the reliant, we'll come to take him down. Then Jesus gave a loud cry, and breathed his life. So women 
from a distance. Among them were Mary Magdalene and Mary the mother of James the younger and Joseph and Salome who followed him when he was in Galilee and administered to him. And there were many other women who had come up with him to Jerusalem. When evening had come, and since it was the day of preparation, that is the day before the Sabbath, Joseph of Arimathea, a respected member of the council, who was himself waiting for the kingdom of God, went boldly to Pilate and asked for the body of Jesus. And Pilate wondered if he were already there, and summoning the centurion, he asked him, whether he had been dead for some time when he learned from the centurion that he was already dead. He gave the body to Joseph. in a tomb cut out of rock. Then he rolled a stone against the entrance of the tomb. Mary Magdalene and Mary the mother 